people really don't like me on the basketball court. It's true. In high school, I was the same way. Like, I was just a really intense, passionate, competitive, honestly, almost like a mean player. A person that usually you don't necessarily like unless you're playing with them. And that completely changes once you get off the court with me. I've become a really humble person. When I'm off the court, when I'm outside of those lines, I'm just a goofy guy, just like any other person. And just like being there for my team, being there for my coaches, being there for anyone that needs me. The point guard is an extension of the coach. And if the leader within the lines is too riled up, too crazy, not focused enough, things can happen that are usually negative. I can now process that I'm doing something wrong, that I'm out of con not out of control, but I'm just not as focused as I should be, and I can recognize that, and then I can change it and then apply it to the rest of the team. So if I'm snapping, I go, all right, Austin, whew. like just breathe, and instead of going crazy still, I just focus and I start being a lot more positive. I start talking more, I get people in the right positions, I'm talking to people in their ear off, off the court. I'm not necessarily complaining about fouls, like all that stuff doesn't matter. It's more about where do I want the team to get to once I recognize, you know, situations where I'm being negative. When I came into college, it was more like my attitude, the way I approached the game, the mentality, the mean mentality, the cocky mentality that I had was what got me there. So all I ever thought was this is the way to do it. And you know, it takes someone to come into your life and change something that's so rooted in you, so deep in your heart, you know, like just the passion that I played with. And he really did take me, sat me in a room, you know, having lessons with me, just talking about life and just like where I am and where I gotta get to. One as a player, two as a leader, and three as a person. I don't think a lot of players get to feel that or you know, programs get to feel that. It's the way Coach Lang was, he's a great person. Me and him have a really crazy connection. Like I can say anything to him and we'll have a conversation just like me and my best friend. So having someone there that I can really talk to, even when I'm like, Frustrated, I can let it all out to him and he won't be quick to judge. He won't be quick to snap on me. It's just a different type of person that I'm extremely happy and I know the rest of my team feels the same way to be with Coach Langle and be with this program. I usually try and take something from every meeting that we have, which is a good thing. I think that's a good quality of mine that I'll that I listen and you know try and change as best I can. Not saying that everything Coach Langle says I do. I'm not his puppet. I'm like I'm still an individual. However, he helps to guide me tremendously. And I'd say one of the biggest things that he's taught me is literally to learn with whatever situation comes. I keep praising the man, but he's just a great person. He's a great father figure for me mentor.